Hey kids, so you made a bubble map that described somebody in your family. Now we're going to make a new one that responds to literature and describes Max from where the wild things are. Now we just read this this morning, so we should be able to come up with a bubble map for him without too much trouble. Remember that we're going to write his name right in the middle, and then we're going to put the circle around it. If we made the circle first and then tried to write the word inside, it could get sloppy. Words that could describe Max. Adjectives. One is rowdy. In the beginning of the book, he is rowdy and rambunctious, and he gets sent to his room. And when he gets sent to his room, he is grounded. Now, remember, I'm writing the word first, and then I'm circling it. That helps it stay neat. And while he's grounded up in his room, he's very bored. He doesn't want to be there. And also, uh, you might come up with different adjectives if you were doing this. This is just the ones that I'm coming up with right now. But it's okay if you would come up with different ones. Now, he's not bored for long because he uh, ends up selling to the island where the wild things are. And he very quickly becomes respected. They make him their king. So I write respected, attach it to Max. And as much fun as he's having, he also misses home. I'm saying that he is homesick. This is another adjective that, that describes Max, homesick. So he decides to sell back home, and he gets uh, into his room and finds that his dinner is waiting for him, and he is happy. Now, just like that, we have created a bubble Max for Max, a bubble map for Max. What I want you guys to do is to create a bubble map of your own. I want you to read a book. As always, make sure that the book is at your level. Pick one character to describe. You're going to construct a bubble map. You're going to pick one character, and you'll use adjectives that describe that character. And then, tomorrow, we're going to learn a new thinking map that will allow us to describe more than one character at one time. We'll talk about it then.